Let's do a blast to the past and go back to 2020. The Steelers fired their offensive coordinator because in three years, they only made it to the playoffs once, and in that playoff appearance, they got first rounded by the Cleveland Browns. And with all the memes and things been going around, you've probably heard his name before. So the Steelers hired this guy, and his name is Matt Canada. And in his first season, the Steelers make the playoffs, but just barely. But Mike Tomlin sees that that's just like his first season. So let him be. Sticks for another season. Steelers miss the playoffs, even though they have a winning record. But the next year after that, the 2023-24 season would turn out to be a disaster. Why do you ask the season is a disaster? Uh, the Steelers are on a good start. They're 6-4. and four. It's not too bad. But if you've seen the games and seen the stats, you'll see and find out that the Steelers are inching their way to a win in every fourth quarter matchup, just barely in a low-scoring extravaganza because the defense is kind of carrying them. So let's say it's like a game and they score only 10 points, but the defense only allows three because the defense actually is uh, performing really well. But 10 points and we have such a good quarterback and a good in incredible receivers. We used to blame it on the offensive line a couple years earlier that they were just getting to the quarterback, which was true on the other hand. But it's starting to prove its ugly face. That is, this is Matt Canada's fault. Like, the offense is just struggling, and they have such great potential. Kenny Pickett's such a great quarterback, and he's just being misused, clearly. Now, let's take it to November 21st, 2023, which actually is today as I am recording. And this morning, the Steelers fans woke up to incredible news. After media, players, and all these people have been rioting to fire this crappy offensive coordinator, it finally happened. This morning, as or November 21st morning, two days before Thanksgiving, Matt Canada is fired. Oh yeah, also, before the video ends, I swear, the comments and memes on this situation are so funny, and I recommend you to read them. Just have a good laugh and read about how crappy Matt Canada is, you know. Well, end of the video. Subscribe. Get me to 200. Maybe I'll do something special.